guys, it's Mike. And Holly. And we've got a new game today called Dr. Beaker. Shake it, stir it, solve it. Dr. Beaker, we're going to become... Scientists. Scientists. <laughs> Bad <coming>. scientists. <laughs> <laughs> so we do need, to, do need to thank Blue Orange Games for sending this to us. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Let's, see Let's do an unboxing. Oh, there's little tiny beakers. Oh, and we've got molecules. Oh, there oh, they go. Oh, there they go, the molecules. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, my so goodness. These these little, so they are plastic. <laughs> They've so. got some little doodad inside. That, well, that's our sorting tray for the game. Oh and we my have, gosh. So we have four of these, so you can have um, four players. We have our little stirring uh, sticks, which are going to help us to stir the <laughs> molecules into place. And then we have a, a, a huge stack of cards here. So this game is for ages eight and up, and it is two to four players because you do have four beakers to use. Right, and then we also have the instructions, which I've already taken out and started reading. And the idea is going to be to, we, we get two of each color of the little molecule balls. So, um, and we each have a beaker with a little separating tray on the bottom. And we'll flip over a card and we have to match this um, card. <sighs> So using just the little stirring, you're good stick. at the speed stuff like that. <laughs> yeah, but you're you're better at um, you have to use like critical thinking because you can only have like two balls or two molecules in the center at a time. So you have to kind of figure out how to move them and get them in the right place before the other person. You know what I mean? <laughs> so you have to use strategy to try to get them in the right place. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to cut the cards open because they are in plastic, shuffle them up, and then we are going to play Dr. Beaker. Okay, so we have our beakers set up and ready to go. This little uh, tray in the bottom does spin, and there is a central compartment. So you can see I have an orange and a purple Which has two divots molecule. for two balls. Right. So, but you can, during play, have three balls in the center, three molecules in the center. So what, what the idea is, is we're going to flip over the top <laughs> card and we have to match that card using just our little uh, stir stick. And by moving the balls through the center compartment, so we can't skip over top of the other balls or um, go over these little walls that are in between. We have to go through the center compartment to move the molecules around. I'm th I think I'm gonna be pretty bad Gosh, at this. This is gonna be, it's hard <laughs> to see. I can't I mean, either. it's kinda, uh, we apologize if it's hard for you guys to kinda see what we got going on. Yeah. It's kinda hard for us cause we're, like, we're gonna have to like look down into the little beakers, but anyway, it's, I'm pretty excited about the whole concept of it. Okay, so uh, the first person to match the card shouts Eureka. And if you're correct, you get to keep that card as a point. First person to 10 points is the winner. Okay. The well, scientist. No, let's do first to five because... This could take a while. No, if we play to 10, you could get five and I could get five. Well, I guess it'd be the first player to 10. First, so it'd be the first player that gets five. I don't think I'm going to do that well. I don't think you have to worry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> first player to five wins. Okay, first Are to five. Are you ready? I'm ready. Uh, oh, dear. Uh, oh, these are kind of tricky to move. Hold on. Green. Oh, oh, man. Concentration. Green, green. Uh. <laughs> purple. Green, green, purple. Now I got to figure out. Orange. Oh, and you gotta line that up. The hole up pretty good too. Eureka! Are you sure you got it? Yes, I am. Oh no, that one went over the top. <laughs> okay, Eureka! But it didn't count because it went over the top. Uh, because I got it first. Purple, orange. Oh, see? <laughs> I think you're totally it's gonna just, cream it, me. It's gonna be a matter of of now you've learned how to do it. You'll get quicker. Yeah, that, that could be true. Okay. okay, you get to flip this one. So we leave the balls where they are, the molecules, where they are for the next play. So we don't have to like, you know, we just we just keep going. Ready? Yep. Oh, another green, green. Green, green. Oh, wow, this is really hard. Orange. Purple. I cannot get it out of the little thing. 
Oh no, get out of there. Uh, Eureka. Green, green, orange, purple, purple, orange, purple. Yep, I got it. <laughs> I didn't want to stop and keep Well, you know, you. I think you can tilt it. Well, that's what to I help, did. To help roll the ball On out. one of them, I tilted it because I, it is really hard to turn. Um, Do I, am I using use the wrong this end? Skinny end. I don't know. It didn't say in the That'll directions, help. but there is a fat end and a skinny end. I think the skinny works easier. That'll help. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I got to use the skinny end. And yeah, like you're probably going to see us tilt it because that's going to make it easier. Ready? Mm -hmm. Sure. <laughs> Go. Green, green. Ooh, this one's a little tougher. Orange. Right? Oh, green, shoot. Green. <laughs> Do I have it? Eureka! Darn, I was close. Hold on. Check. No, me. I wasn't. Purple, purple, orange, <laughs> green, green. Yes, I got it. Eureka. Oh, man. Wow, I have to. I'm not. This is hard for me. I totally made a mistake on mine. I have to really focus on this. <laughs> like, this isn't coming easy for me for some reason. Okay, is it your turn to flip or mine? Me, you, me, you. Okay, ready? Yep. Go. Eureka. Green, orange. Oh. Green, orange, purple. Eureka. Green, purple. Yep, I got it. Green, purple, orange. Oh. <laughs> I have a hard time with that one. I know. It's easy when all four or all six are in a thing, but not so easy when you've got like to do one in the middle. Yeah, I do one in the middle in the common area. Okay. Darn. Three to one. You'd like just beat me on that one. Ready? Too. Go. Oh, I can't do that. How are you supposed to get? I don't want to use guts to go. Oh, man. Green. Orange. Eureka. No way, really. Yep. Oh, that was good. Two purples top, two oranges bottom, two green side. See, I can't. I can't. I'm like looking and I'm spinning and I'm like, I can't figure it out. Okay. It, Did you it's win? you, me, yeah. you, me, you, me. So you flip the next one. Uh, I need one more. I got four. Oh, you need one more. Yeah, well, you're going to win it because I can't. <laughs> I can't grasp okay, the concept. Go. Purple, green, orange, orange. That takes too much thinking. <laughs> did you get it? Yeah. Yeah, you did. Yep. You won. Really? Yeah. I'm. Th I cannot. It's a matter of what's it called? Not like sequencing, but. Okay. What is this called? So there. Uh, Methodically move the molecule. It's yeah. Blue orange makes another game that's similar to this called. I think it was Eureka. Who did better in that? Are and it was the one where the, it was the test tubes. The test tube one? Where you switched the balls back and forth. I don't remember who did better. I think you might have done better. But now, if you were to challenge me to that game, I'm really good at it. Because <laughs> I practiced it and practiced it. Like, I played it a lot with Chelsea and with Alex. I'll have to go back and see. Because for some reason, I thought you beat me at that one. Oh, yeah. I'll have to 
take a look. We'll have to watch the footage. Yeah, I think it's called Eureka, which is a similar similar game to the Blue Orange. Uh, I still Dr. play Eureka. that one. I play that one a lot with the kids, and so I'm really practiced at it, and I'm really good at that one. I'm really good at it. But this, I Start guess I need to practice. I like this one. It's just like the activeness of it. I see, and, I... and concentration. It's hard to see in there. I'm telling you that. To look right in that yeah. tube and to know where the opening is you really gotta like focus on that yeah and see that's the part where i can't plan ahead like that like i can't plan okay well i gotta move this one so i could put it here like i'm not good at that i was good at certain puzzle games like that a yeah. square puzzle game that goes like this i can't i think, can think moves ahead i can't i can't think like several steps ahead i just can't do it <laughs> i'm like living the moment I like, like what's right game. in front of me not just because i won I, I just, I think it's cool. Like science something. <laughs> oh, no, or something. I think it's cool, too. I'm just frustrated because I don't I think Chelsea's going to gonna like playing this. Like, just moving yeah. the balls around and stuff. I'm just frustrated because I, I don't have it figured out yet. But if I practice and play. Okay, you practice and maybe we'll come back. We might have to uh, yeah. dig up Dr. Eureka and do a little challenge on oh, that. Oh, yeah, I know again. right where it is because I play it all the time. <laughs> <laughs> so, thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> Be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye. Bye.